Now I have to ask you, how do you like the shoes? Yeah, yeah. They were a hand-me-down from Liberace. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the fabulous Linda Gentile and the Jersey Shore Pops. Gentile. When I'm in France, je m'appelle Linda Gentile. When I'm in Italy, do we have any Italians out there? Mi chiamo Linda Gentile. And when I'm in China, this is the hard one. This is a very long name. My Chinese name. Linda Gentile. Can you all repeat that? And when I'm in Israel, call me anything but this. It's Linda Gentile. I was a child protege of Liberace. He gave me my and choices that year. One was to go on tour with Liberace. The other was to go on tour with Julio Iglesias. Now, who do you think I wanted to go with? <laughs> Julio. Oh, he was so charming. But my mother, she's a nice Italian lady. She said, Linda, if you will go with a Julio, I will worry about you every night, a wild and crazy Latin man. But if you will go with a Liberace, ah, I know you'll be a safe. I'll explain that to the rest of you later. Well. Tonight, it's always different. Who do you think I look like tonight? Liberace, God, I hope not. Okay. <laughs> okay, how about now? Sarah, yeah, that's Sarah. Well, you know, when they tell you you look like a movie star or a singer or something, it's, it's flattering, you know, it's very, very nice. But when you start looking like a politician, something is wrong. It is downright dangerous, especially in New Jersey. So I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so I got the perfect answer, you see. If you are a Republican, I hope you think I look like Sarah. If you're a Democrat, Tina Fey. <laughs> and many people in China do say that I have the world's fastest fingers when they see this. And we do have a, a few guests here from China, so let me translate that. And I know I have a few people here from Japan. And now I will translate for my friends who are here from California, Texas, and Florida. Muchas personas dicen que tengo los dedos más rápidos del mundo. No sé si es... Please enjoy this song. The Chinese title is called Liang Shambu Ju Ying Tai. It. Thank you. Many years 
years ago, wow. my parents were very adventurous and they traveled all over China. Everyone wants to know why I speak Chinese and why I go to China. Well, they love China, they traveled there and they even got married there. Yes, and they spent their honeymoon there in a beautiful city called Hangzhou. And nine months later, I was born. So you could say I was made in China. <laughs> Thank you like everything else in America. Thank you so much. Oh, you're a great audience. And I just saw someone taking a picture. Now, I wasn't ready for that. Okay, wait. I'm ready now. On the count of three, okay? One, two, three.